Jr. here from Pumpkin Pulp. First off, thank you so much for sharing our videos, passing it around. We really, really appreciate it. We're going to be featuring a new mask today, or actually it's our old mask. It's one of our biggest sellers. Um, back when we were first starting out, it was about the only mask we had at the time, and that is the original hog mask. So here it is. Um, it's actually made out of latex. Most all of our masks are latex and has straps in the back. Um, this is actually mask. Um, this is the only mask that I've never sculpted. Now, I know you're thinking, well, who sculpted it? But the real answer is Mother Nature. I actually, on this one, went down to the butcher shop and got a real hog's head. I thought, you know what? Why sculpt it when you can just go get it? So this is actually the only mask I did that to. Um, so yeah, went to the butcher, got a real hog head, molded it. Um, I don't know if you know anything about Ultra Cow, but uh, it starts heating up when it starts setting, so it got really hot and there was kind of a ham smell in the shop that day. Um, I know you're thinking probably bacon, but no, it was definitely more of a savory ham smell. I like a nice ham. You think that's wrong? We're just enjoying the flavors of a fallen friend. True. Um, not the most pleasant job, kind of gross. Oh, squeal, squeal. But uh, the end result turned out great, I thought. Uh, got the exact replica of the head. So uh, we're going to put this on here and show you how it fits. We get a lot of questions about that. This is, uh, like I said, this is definitely one of our more popular ones. Um, the only thing on this one, since it's off a of real hog's head, the vision on it is not quite as sharp as some of the other masks, but the overall look is definitely one to that, uh, that gets people and definitely has to remember. So. So that's how it fits. Um, I know we get a lot of people always ask me, hey, is it from the Saw movie? No, it's not from the Saw movie. You're mocking me, aren't you? Actually, we had ours before Saw. What I did get it from, though, because I'm old school, I got it from a movie called Motel Hell. Vincent? So that's kind of where I remember seeing as a kid the first person wearing a pig head. So if you haven't seen the movie, check it out. It's great. It's so bad it's great. I love it. <laughs> it's just, it's it's great. Farmer Vincent's fritters. I mean, hey. Funny looking critters, ain't they, Vincent? Yeah, maybe so. Yeah. But you know as well as I do, it takes all kinds of critters to, to make, make Farmer, Farmer Vincent, Vincent fritters. fritters. <laughs> How can you go wrong? So yeah, check that one out, but uh, that's kind of where the, I got the idea. Um, the movie, it was definitely a lot sillier looking. Not as realistic, but hey, it was, uh, I think it was 1980 or something when it came out, so check it out. Uh, but this is our original hog mask, so here's one for you. You can see how it fits and all that, but uh, definitely one that we're always getting orders for. So thanks a lot for watching this week, and we'll be back next time. Stay tuned. Thanks. Bye.